Hello, it's Tommy. I wanted to uh, do a quick video today to talk about the genealogy of Jesus. Um, see, this is the interlinear Bible. Matthew chapter 1, verse 2. Abraham fathered Isaac, Isaac fathered Jacob, Jacob fathered Judah and his brothers. And then there it is in the, the original Greek. Okay. Well, the Amplified also shows Judah, Jacob, the father of Judah. All right. And this one is the NIV. Abraham was the father of Isaac, Isaac the father of Jacob, Jacob the father of Judah. All right, and this one is the new King James. Abraham begot Isaac, Isaac begot Jacob, and Jacob begot Judah and his brothers. Okay, well in the King James, Um, Abraham begot Isaac, Isaac begot Jacob, and Jacob begot Judas and his brethren. Judas. Now, I know that this Judas here could not be the same Judas Iscariot that uh, was the traitor because Judas Iscariot was alive you know, when the same time Jesus was alive, obviously, and so this was several generations before, but honestly, when you hear the name Judas, I mean, what what do you think? Uh, you automatically think of Judas Iscariot. Now, supposedly, uh, Judas is the Greek form of Judah, but that makes no sense because now this is the same the same Bible where it says Judas right there, but Hebrews chapter eight, verse eight says Judah. So if they're gonna use the argument you know, that this is the the Greek word of Judah, then this should say Judas right here. And also in Revelations, I thought I marked Revelation. I guess I didn't. 5-5. Five, five. I'm really sorry about this. Now this one is kind of weird. Um, because this one dropped the A. Now this was the lion of the tribe of Judah. So I, you know, I think that is a change too. I don't remember the H not being there on that Judah right there. So anyway, um, I don't know. It's just so disheartening to see these discrepancies popping up left and right in our Bibles now. I don't know. Okay, I'll stop rambling. Uh, but I'd like to know what you think about Jesus coming from the line of Judas now. All right, have a good day.